line as he delivers the ball by Greg Lloyd, one of those blitzing linebackers. Well, the one thing the Packers didn't want to happen today is just exactly they have two tight ends in there to protect the quarterback. You know it's going to be a pass with both tight ends. Greg Lloyd matched up against it. A tight end blows right line. Brett Favre goes deep. Greg Lloyd sends him airborne. We saw Greg Lloyd yesterday, day before yesterday, and without a shirt on, and you can throw a dart at his chest and it's going to bounce off. I never saw anybody that, that solid in my life, and this guy loves to play. And far, the play action slowed things down, didn't get the block on Lloyd, and, man, he just go and he knocked him about four feet. They brought the extra tight end in to help the quarterback, but what they did, you can't put him on Greg Lloyd like that. So... A lot of Green Bay hopes are in the throats there in Wisconsin after that hit by far. Ty Detmer will take over for the Packers. I could see how Lloyd got in on Favre. But once the left tackle, Gary Brown, number 71, he's going to block down on Ray Sills, number 97 for the Pittsburgh. Craig Lloyd now makes a great outside fake, comes underneath. And what's confusing about this, Yesterday, Mike Holmgren said they would take the tight end of the tackle and double out on Lloyd. There, they had to have a blown assignment. They didn't do it. 